little DLX device, pretty cool. Whoa, sideways, wow. Today, we're gonna try something out. We're gonna test out one of these throttle controllers from Solar Performance. I'm not gonna get a kickback from this, but we do have discount codes down below. Just trying to save you guys a little bit of money, heads up. But these 2024 Mustangs cannot still be tuned unless you go Whipple or the new Roush coming out. <laughs> Ford, come on, let's go. Let's unlock everything. Anyway, we can't tune them yet. So how do we make this car feel better? And that's why I wanted to try something like this. All right, I really wanted to try to wake this car up as much as possible. So I'm gonna try one of these throttle controllers now. Yeah, here in the comments already Alex those things are snake oil. They don't work. Um, well, I would beg to differ I've used some of these things in the past. They do really honestly help the car to feel better How do I explain this? What they do is they manipulate throttle input amperage as you accelerate or as you push down on the Accelerator pedal you can fine-tune how you want the car to feel this offers the sport and like a ludicrous mode Which is gonna be insane so, okay, so we're gonna give it the old Junior Varsity try and see if we can get this Mustang to feel better. Even with the factory tune, the throttle is still, it's got that dead space. It's got that dead space in the throttle and I get why, but I don't like it. I want the car to feel like really alive and snappy. We're gonna give it an honest test. Hopefully all goes well. Doesn't add more power, but it's gonna allow us to reach that power band a little bit quicker, which makes a huge difference. So let's go install it. Let's give it a test. Let's see what happens. We're in drag mode, and this is the OEM. So stock tune, drag mode feels pretty good. It's pretty punchy, but again, hopefully we can improve that. Let's go back to sport mode. This is the one I really like on the street. And he just kind of rolls into the RPM. But I definitely want it to be a little bit more fun and snappy. What you get in the box, throttle controller here, little DLX controller, pigtail module. It's gonna go in between the device and your gas pedal, your accelerator. A couple zip ties and some instructions. The very first thing we need to do is turn ignition off, which we did. You gotta open up all of the doors. I'm gonna do the trunk as well and leave that for 10 minutes. That way everything discharges all the electricity driver door 10 minute countdown countdown is done little DLX device pretty cool pretty small I'm gonna try to figure out where I want it to go I actually think that what I'm gonna do is right there in that area that vicinity is where I'm gonna stick it the pigtail itself so it's gonna go in line with your accelerator but they also give you a ton of slack as you guys can see so I think we'll be okay I'm gonna give it a shot I think it's gonna be a really clean place to mount it Perfect. Now we got a little bit of slack on each side so we can run and tuck some wires looking good But I think that's a pretty clean spot to be able to do it and then just run the wires tuck them up that way And then again come down through this area here All right So the cool thing is looking at it before we run wires We want to make sure that we can get to the accelerator uh, Wires up there the pigtail that we need to un unhook looks like we don't need to disconnect the accelerator pedal which is a good thing and plug it in between and then we should be good is this worth it is it actually going to do anything is it just snake oil time will tell just like that zip tie up out of the way we did have a whole lot of slack that was left over start the car and let's see on the controller display press and hold both buttons for a few seconds So we got a four digit number there. And then on our smartphone, we're gonna download the app. And there it is, right up top, all right. Allow Bluetooth, we're gonna add a device. Pair, and bam, there we go. We got OEM mode, definitely comfort. That's gonna be your sport modes. Two, four, and five. And then you got your ludicrous mode, which is gonna be a very snappy, very quick throttle. We're gonna test all these out. We also have drag mode. 
You have an AI mode, which is interesting. This is uh, essentially going to help learn as you drive. It's going to learn the car, kind of like an automatic transmission would do for the S550. Going, you got a valet mode, and then you have diff different increments, so you can, you know, different levels. Uh, it looks like probably wet mode, economy mode. As I'm clicking, it's also shifting around on here. You can drag this around, Sport Mode 5. Pretty, that's pretty cool. All right, so let's get on the road and give this a test. We got no lights, no warnings. Everything looks to be good. We're gonna start in probably the OEM mode and see how that feels. It should feel just like it did stock and then increase from there. Let's go. I do have the MGW Race Spec short throw and the Steeda uh, little clutch spring that definitely helps driving this car too. Alright, so OEM already feels good. You know what? We're going right into sport. Sport's where it's at. Still OEM on the throttle controller. into the, the, the pedal a lot quicker. Ooh. Little donut. <laughs> uh, wow. That's that's sport. That's SP5 on the controller in sport mode on the dash. <laughs> Alright. Let's go to Ludicrous. Let's see if let's go to Ludicrous 5. Let's just see what this feels like. Alright. In sport mode, Ludicrous 5. Dang. Oh crap. Alright. The traffic. Wow. Alright. We're at a dead stop right now. Just try to accelerate. Traction control still on too. So traction is going to be off. Yep. Traction is off. I don't have it. I'm not taking advanced track all the way off. Not with this. So we're still in Ludicrous 5. Oh, we just revs a lot faster too. That's nuts. I 
too short. It's... Oh, we blew the tires off. Good thing we got that BMR suspension on. It keeps the car straight. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm speed to the state. That's that, I really like how fast it revs. That's nuts. Put it into um, economy. I guess let's go back to sp like sport mode. That's like my daily driving uh, mode, and then drag mode. Oh, there's AI, valet, wet, economy mode nine. Let's give this a shot. See how dead it feels. Yeah, I got to push like all the way in, and then it revs. Ooh, it's slouchy. we didn't do yet is drag mode on the car and drag mode on the device. Let's try that out. Sport mode five. Let's try this again. like lurch forward like that every single time I shift it, it just throws the car forward because it's getting into the RPM like really fast that's this feels like go buy one of these it works not snake oil I'm telling you this is this is uh, this is interesting this is pretty freaking cool what's great is we can fine-tune how we want the car to feel. There's like a ton of options, which is really neat. So I'm, 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 I'm like beyond impressed, beyond impressed. Solar performance, uh, video, <laughs> I can't speak. Discount codes in the video description to pick up one of these. I think it saves like 10% or something like that. I'm not getting paid to say that. I'm not getting paid. I don't make any money off of you buying this device or anything like that. Don't think that. This is um, definitely worth it. Second drop, five step. Wow. <laughs> it just, the car's an animal now. This is nuts. All right, so I'm going to continue play with this thing. It definitely works. Definitely, definitely 1,000 million percent works. Um, not snake oil. And um, the device is, it's, it's pretty affordable. I just wanted to give it a test. I wanted to, you know, we can't tune these things yet. So how do we get around that? We can add things like headers and some other power mods uh, as much as we can, like maybe some intakes or this or that, but on the factory tune. So, but how do we get the car to feel better and get rid of that dead space in the pedal? And this solved it. I'm beyond beyond impressed all right i'm going to continue driving this is like way too good to stop now but i'm going to end the video here discount codes down beneath i'm not making money if you guys go buy this i'm just saying that this definitely works so very impressed very impressed all right guys that's the video stay tuned as always for what's coming in the future because still have a lot of mods some of which are in the garage ready to install right now so subscribing is free. We are on our way to 50,000 subscribers. I cannot get there without your help. And I appreciate it. And I uh, will see you guys later. God bless. See ya.